Hello, bonjour, comment ça va Well, it's official, the Oculus Go is a go-go. Alright, let's dive right in. By the way, welcome back to VR Essentials, where we talk about the practical uses of VR. My name is Lazio SK, and this is huge, massive news as it's been announced by Facebook that they will be dropping the Oculus Go later this year accepting the last Oculus Go apps by December 4th and by December 18 they will stop all new apps into the Oculus Go store. This amazing headset which has sold nearly 3 million units or perhaps more since its launch in 2018 it will however still get patch fixes and certain bug fixes until 2022 when it will retire after that facebook and i quote have said you've told us loud and clear that six off feels like the future of vr that's why we're going all in and we won't be shipping any more three off vr products will end sales of the oculus go headset this year as we double down on improving our offerings for quest and rift it doesn't really come to a surprise that you know the oculus go would be dropped sooner or later because of course they had to but what really is kind of surprising is that they are dropping it seems freed off altogether now this is because qualcomm have parted recently with so many different brands i mean we're talking about 30 or 50 different brands who are all going to be releasing as soon as 2021 various different MR and 3DOS headsets. So be it, some of them will be tethered, but some of them will also be standalone. So for them to be outside of the entire space and lose that potential revenue is kind of surprising. Is it just a marketing ploy by Facebook, you know, trying to demoralize the market and their potential competitors and tell them, look, we've done the surveys, we've asked questionnaires to thousands and thousands of people. And at the end of the day, 3DOS, you can release them as much as you want, but it's dead, we don't care. Or is it that really they have something up their sleeve and during Oculus Connect 7, which let's not forget, they have other things to announce, for example, Facebook Horizon and various different other things. Perhaps, perhaps they might actually announce the Oculus Go 2, which we think might actually be a media hand tracking device. So hmm, who knows? At the end of the day, this headset is really, really popular. The world's first standalone VR headset, even though it was three doves. I tell you, when I take it on the plane, I really have so much fun and it serves so many different industries for so many different applications. I mean, we're really, really going to miss it. But at the end of the day, we have to also be excited because what's to come next is only going to be 10 times better. I would like to thank you for watching today's video. Remember to hit the like and subscribe. Share some love so that you and I together we can grow the community and help as many people in VR. All right, until next time, stay safe, take it easy. And as always, DJ, take it away. What can I do?